You know when I sit down or stand up. You know my thoughts, even when I'm far away. You see me when I travel and when I rest at home. You know everything I do. You know what I'm going to say even before I say it, Lord. Psalm chapter 139 verses 2 to 4. We all have fears and worries. Your worries may be different than mine, but we all stress about going through life with unmet needs. The only way to take away the worries of this life is to entrust them to a God who knows your needs. Like Psalm 139 declares, God knows when you sit down or stand up. He knows your thoughts. He knows your need before you even go to Him in prayer to make your request. He loves us so much, and it's so important that we hold on to this truth with all that we have. Because when life is not going the way you want it, and all you are experiencing is pain, disappointment, loss, and defeat, just to mention a few, you need to know that God has got your back and that he knows exactly what you need. In the book of Acts, we read of a man who was crippled from birth. And a man lame from birth was being carried, whom they laid daily at the gate of the temple, that is called Beautiful Gate, to ask alms of those entering the temple. Seeing Peter and John about to go into the temple, he asked to receive alms. Acts chapter 3, verse 2. Yes, the man need money to live, but there was something even more important that he needed. And even though he didn't ask Peter and John for healing, God knew exactly what the man needed. And through Peter and John gave it to him. And Peter directed his gaze at him, as did John, and said, Look at us. And he fixed his attention on them, expecting to receive something from them. But Peter said, I have no silver and gold, but what I do have I give to you. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, rise up and walk. And he took him by the right hand and raised him up, and immediately his feet and ankles were made strong. Acts chapter 3 verses 4 to 7. What an amazing God we serve. He is the creator of the universe, and yet he knows our individual needs. He focuses on us. He knows us so intimately, more than the closest person in our life. The Lord knew what the man really needed and gave it to him before he asked for it. Actually, he didn't even ask to be healed. He asked for money and God in his goodness gave him something a million times better. When things don't look good, it's easy to doubt God. Instead of proclaiming his goodness, we start questioning God's goodness. Instead of proclaiming his power, we start professing our weaknesses and before long we are living a life of worry. But we must not forget the words of Jesus in the book of Matthew. So don't worry about these things, saying, What will we eat? What will we drink? What will we wear? These things dominate the thoughts of unbelievers, but your heavenly Father already knows all your needs. Matthew chapter 6, verses 31 to 32. We spend so much time telling God our needs when He already knows our needs. He knows each need that you have. He knows that need that is keeping you up at night. God is telling us in Matthew 6 to not worry because He knows your needs. You don't need to spend time dwelling on your worries because He already has in mind what your needs are from the very beginning. God knows your needs and will meet above your needs. Trust God in whatever He may be asking you to do. He will always tell you to do what will best meet your needs. 
God will never ask you to do something that will harm you or leave you with a miserable life. The enemy wants you and me to take things into our own hands and away from God's hands, but we must remember that only God can give us what we need. How beautiful and wonderful is that? We have a God who loves us so much to tell us to not worry, but that he will take care of us. When we truly grasp how much God loves us, we should have no more room to worry. If you then, who are evil, know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more will your Father who is in heaven give good things to those who ask him? Matthew chapter 7 verse 11 God is a good father, and just like any good father, he will take care of us. And because God is almighty and above all, he can and will provide for us more than what we need. God doesn't just give us what is good enough, but gives us the best. Never doubt God's mighty power to work in you and accomplish all this. He will achieve infinitely more than your greatest request your most unbelievable dream and exceed your wildest imagination. He will outdo them all, for his miraculous power constantly energizes you. Ephesians chapter 3 verse 20 That's how great God's love is for us. He gives us more than what we ask and what we could ever get ourselves. If you're in a season of waiting for God to answer your prayer, hold on to his love and goodness. God knows what you need and intends to give you more than what you need. God cannot bless those who are trying to take things into their own hands. He can only bless those whose arms are stretched out to receive his blessings. So remember, God knows what you need. Let's pray. King Jesus, we are so thankful that you know what we need. Even before we speak it out, you already know. We ask you to help us to remember this powerful truth, especially in times when it seems like you are silent. Even when we pray and pray and no answer comes, you care about us and love us and have only the best in store for us. May we not settle for things that are below what you want us to have. We come to you in confidence, Lord. You know exactly what we need. Lord, we confess that at times we allow worry and fear to cloud our minds and hearts. We become consumed by the cares of this world, forgetting that you are in control of every situation. Help us to release our burdens to you, knowing that you are more than capable of handling them. Strengthen our faith, O Lord, that we may trust in your provision and timing, even when the answers to our prayers seem distant. Just as you knew the needs of the crippled man at the beautiful gate, you know our needs before we even bring them to you. You are a God who sees beyond our outward appearances and understands the deepest desires of our hearts. Thank you for the countless times you have met our needs and provided for us in ways we could never have imagined. In moments of doubt and uncertainty, remind us of your promises, Lord. Your word assures us that you are a good father who delights in giving good gifts to your children. Help us to rest in your goodness and to confidently approach your throne of grace, knowing that you hear our prayers and answer them according to your perfect will. May we not be swayed by the fleeting concerns of this world, but instead fix our eyes on you the author and perfecter of our faith. Fill us with your peace that surpasses all understanding, guarding our hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. 
Empower us to live boldly and courageously, knowing that you are with us every step of the way. As we surrender our worries and fears to you, Lord, we ask for the strength to wait patiently for your timing. Grant us the wisdom to discern your voice amidst the noise of the world and the humility to follow your leading, even when it may seem counterintuitive to our human understanding. Thank you, Father, for your faithfulness and love that never fail. Help us to cultivate hearts of gratitude and praise, even in the midst of life's storms. May your name be glorified in all that we say and do. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.